you can begin to feel a little bit of more excitement in the air right now. They're getting ready to bring in the new year. We've got about three minutes to go here, and boy, oh boy, are they packed in tonight. That body heat alone is keeping them warm. Now, we're going to say goodbye to 1998, but at the same time, hi there <laughs> in the office building. We're also going to say goodbye to the good old ball, the aluminum ball that's been dropping here for years. They spent $75,000 refurbishing it uh, a couple of years ago, and lo and behold, they've got it back in shape this year, and they're going to get rid of it at the end of this year. Believe it or not, they tested it yesterday and works beautifully. It's 500 pounds, 180, 75, one halogen lamps, 144 glitter uh, strobe lights inside, 10,000, 12,000 rhinestones, a 10,000 watt uh, xenon lamp inside. Listen to that. Temperature 23, wind chill factor zero. Zero. They don't care, but they're going to watch that ball drop, and you'll see it all here. It's going to be a roar that you don't hear like anywhere else in the world as i mentioned the test run yesterday is all computerized went really well the good old days they lowered it with a rope that's our chopper cam and look at them all the way up past 52nd street that's the x shape i was talking about before that is Times square the crossroads of the world by the way the new ball for the next year coming up, I'll tell you about after uh, this one drops out of sight. It's going to be a brand new spectacular thing. And look at that. There's the time. Watch it closely. Oh, it's about a minute and a half before the roar hits here. This is what they've been waiting for since 4 o'clock this afternoon. In a moment or two, they are going to release confetti, the likes of which you've never seen before. 3,500 pounds of confetti will fall. 10,000 pom-poms have been distributed. 30,000 balloons. Uh, we just took a quick shot there of uh, the small world and uh, Sleeping Beauty's castle. They're waiting anxiously. Time's getting close. We're coming up on it. One minute from now. <laughs> oh, yeah. And there it is. There it is. It's beginning to drop. They can see it. This is when the excitement hits in Times Square. What will it be like in the year 2000 if it's like this in 1998, 1999? They are ready. Are they ever ready? It's midway down that 77-foot flagpole. That weighs 500 pounds, and it's all glittering and showing off its best. That's the last drop. 30 seconds, 30. Sound effects are hitting. It's a surround sound effect in Times Square as we come up on 20 seconds to 1999. In 15 seconds. Oh, it's getting close. In 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Happy 1999! are flashing. What a party they throw. Sanglan and Mayor Giuliani, 1999 has arrived in blazing seven-foot letters. Happy New Year everywhere. Over one billion people are watching tonight the world over. And the baby is dancing up a storm. Sleeping Beauty's Castle Fireworks, they'll have fireworks in Central Park here in New York. Isn't that a beautiful sight? 
Lots of favorite friends there. Mickey and Minnie are sure in there somewhere. And the gang in California celebrating along with the New Yorkers. And on stage at Harris in Las Vegas, they'll be going to bring you a lot more music. We've got the greatest act lineup in the world. Backstreet Boys, Bare Naked Ladies, Cherry Pop and Daddy, Chicago, Monica, and Fastball still to come as the celebration rolls in New York. We've got 40 searchlights here, one space cannon. It's the biggest searchlight in the world. And all of the surround sound with all sorts of sound effects. There's a father time puppet. I haven't seen him yet, but he's allegedly going to wander through the square in a while. We should catch sight of him somewhere. Looks like a blizzard, but it's uh, it's confetti, and there's fireworks up there in Central Park. See him up north there? Yeah. There are those searchlights we were talking about. Pandemonium, but it's controlled. They're just having a great time. You got to be here to feel it. Television does pretty well. Small World Celebration is fun, too. Lots of fun down there. A lot warmer, I might add. I don't know what the temperature is in Florida. Here in the blizzard, the wind chill factor is 30. I beg your pardon, I'd say 30. Oh, that'd be a heat wave. It's a zero wind chill factor in New York City. 23 degrees. Thanks once again to New York's finest for helping us have this wonderful party and to a great crew from the Business Improvement District of Times Square. They've done a wonderful job of putting together the biggest party of the year, which continues here on ABC with all the great music on New Year's Rock and Eve 1999. Dick Clark's New Year's Rock and Eve 99.